Guess what we're doing today? Today, you guys, we're gonna make a fun little Valentine's treat. But real quick, before we do that, I have something really cool to show you. Are you ready for the surprise? <gasps> Dun -da -da! Look it! The Kira Ice Princess plushie is available now. If you guys are interested in getting this, there's a link down in the video description below. As always, they are limited. This is a pre-order. Once they're gone, they're gone. But I wanted to make sure that you guys knew they were going to be here. They're so stinking cute. Look, Miss Kira, it's you. You could take the apple off of her, her little frozen apple. She's like, whoa, just my frozen apple. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get to making some treats. So what are we making today? I'm sure you guys already figured it out by the thumbnail and the title. We are making chocolate covered strawberries, but we all know what we really mean. It's carob, not chocolate. Don't feed your dogs chocolate, you guys. We're using carob and probably white yogurt melting discs as well. What do you girls think? Is this gonna be amazing? So we're gonna take these beautiful strawberries and we're gonna turn them into something amazing. Kira is like, um, I can almost reach those strawberries right out of your hands, almost. So because we're gonna be working with melting mm -hmm. chocolate, the dogs are not gonna stay up here the entire time. So before we show you guys this process, they're each gonna get a strawberry. Oh, what a chew. You're such a good chewer. <laughs> Will Memphis, Memphis eat it? She yeah, hates it. She it! Sometimes she doesn't eat strawberries. How about you, Kira? Mm, nom, You're nom, such nom, a good nom, chewer. Nom. Oh man, so now we're gonna put some good stuff on those strawberries and you girls are gonna eat them right up. Okay, so we have our strawberries which have been washed. One of the most important things that you need to know about making this recipe is your strawberries need to be completely dry before you dip them in your carob or your yogurt melting discs. So we're gonna go ahead and we are gonna start drying off these strawberries. While Jamie is doing that, you already figured this out. We are going to be using our adorable little nerdy nummies melting pot and we are going to start melting our carob. Now, if you do not have one of these, there'll be an Amazon affiliate link for one down in the video description below, or you can just melt these in the microwave, doing about 20 to 30 seconds at a time and stirring because you don't want to burn anything. So we're going to go ahead and get this melting. The carob chips. Chocolate covered strawberries, but it's really carob. Carob chips into the melter. And again, I will uh, put an Amazon affiliate link for some of these down below as well. We are using unsweetened carob chips. So to prepare to dip the strawberries, we are going to use these sucker sticks. You can also use bamboo skewers, which is probably a little easier because they have a point on them. But hey, we're going to use what we had, which was some sucker sticks. So you can see there, Jamie cut a little hole in the top and then you stick your stick down in there. And then once this stuff melts, we'll show you what we're gonna do. Oh, these are gonna turn out so cute. So you can see there, he's uh, just putting a little hole in the top because again, these don't have points on them. If you use bamboo ske skewers, they have points on them. It'll be a little easier. Hey, look, our melting pot changed. So the first round of carob chips that we used, uh, they seized on us. So we're now on our second round and they're actually working much better, but we also decided to go ahead and melt the white at the same time. Also, pro tip, carob can sometimes be a pain to work with. Same with uh, the white melting discs or the yogurt discs. Paramount crystals can help a lot. You just add a little bit in and it'll make it nice and shiny again. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and lightly, even though we already dried these, we're gonna do it again. And then we're gonna dip them and spin them. So it is dark in there. It's dark wow. in there. Ooh, we gotta get on that side more. No, you were good, I thought. And kind of let it drip off a little bit and tap it on the side lightly. Mm -hmm. And then we have our parchment paper ready. Set them on the parchment paper. Now, if you're gonna coat them in sprinkles, you're gonna wanna do that immediately, but for the carob ones, we're not doing that. So we're gonna do six of these. So the carob ones look good. These aren't done. We've got an idea to decorate these further, but now we're gonna do the white ones. We're gonna dip it in here, kind of spin it around. Kira, don't steal no stuff. No, nope, I'm watching, we're watching. Ooh, I got some on the- Oh, you did, but you I keep definitely... wanting to call them feathers. They're not feathers. <laughs> Hi, Kira. Oh. And then, Gotta we're gonna quick. come over here. Don't grab those. Don't do it. <laughs> I got her. <laughs> we're gonna come over here and we're gonna just do a little bit of sprinkles as we spin it around. Oh Which my. again, this is optional. You don't have to do it. 
and then we'll set it down here and let it dry. I don't know if that's has to you back there. And do it a whole bunch more times. <laughs> Heck yeah. Ooh, we're making the carob covered ones even prettier. Oh, they're beautiful. All right, we are gonna let these uh, harden and then the dogs are gonna give them a try and possibly Jake. I'm gonna try one. <laughs> so now that we have our strawberries all prepared, we are gonna let them sit and get to about room temperature. They're gonna harden and then the dogs are gonna try them. This is a great time to remind you that this is a treat, not a meal replacement. Please feed your dogs responsibly. And I know everybody's wondering, can you eat them? Well, uh. Let's find out if you can eat them. Also, if you're new to this channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, click that bell to turn on all notifications so you can be notified whenever we put up new videos. All right, they're just about ready for the dogs to try, but everybody wants to know, can people eat these? Uh, we can. I'm gonna choose not to eat the carob ones, <laughs> and I'll go for the, the uh, other one. All right, you eat the dog treat. It smells good. <laughs> oh. Is it a win? Are you wagging your tail? <laughs> oh wow. The dogs mm -hmm. are like, um. I don't think I've ever had that before. Dad, that was for me. I need one of those. All right, now we get to see what the dogs think. Joker. I think we did it. Oh my goodness, these turned out so stinking cute. Let's see what the dogs think. Excitement level 9,000. Memphis gets hers first, and as always, we cut it up for her. Look at that focus. I know, okay, I'm gonna set it right here. What do you think, Memphis? And one gone, oh, two gone. Another one gone. Chocolate fell off of one. Carob, white yogurt melting, ding, melting discs, whatever you wanna call it. And Memphis says, that's a win, that's the best dang thing I ever tasted in my whole life. Everything is the best dang thing you've ever tasted in your whole life, isn't it? And she's gone. What are you doing? Are you spinning for days? Can you turn around? Turn around. There you go. Good job. Okay, ready? Ready, sit. Ready, leave it. Leave it. And in case you guys were wondering, we did cut the tops off of it. Hey, I said leave it. I know this is very difficult. Ready? Okay, take it. We cut the green tops off it. I knew you were going to always. You always want to take it off the placemat and eat it on the rug. Oh, are you going to eat the chocolate off first? You're your mother's child, I tell you what. She's like, yeah, I want the good part first. <laughs> are you even going to eat this strawberry or are you just going to eat the topping? Huh, maybe we should have cut yours in half too. Can I, can I at least put the strawberry back on here? She's like, I don't know how to eat a strawberry. Dad cuts up my strawberries. You really don't know how to eat it? You're hilarious. You want some help? Oh, I think you got it this time. Maybe. You kind of got it. You have no idea what you're doing. There you go. Good job. Oh, are you super excited as well? Can you turn around? Turn around. She's like, how about jump? Okay, all right, ready? Here we go. I'm gonna set your strawberry down. What do you think? Are you gonna do the same thing she did? She's like, yeah. I'm gonna eat the chocolate off and then eat the strawberry. Making a mess, that's what we're doing. Oh, 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 oh yeah, I was gonna say, you almost didn't drop it. You ate the strawberry first. I see a big old chunk of, there you go. Candy coating there for you. Was that a win? She's like, mm, that was delicious. I'll have 12 more, please. Are you all looking for more? I'm pretty sure that was a win. I think they all enjoyed it. Super easy to make, super fun. If you guys end up making this for your dogs, let us know or post your photo on our Facebook page or on our Instagram. We would love to see that. Also, don't forget, Kira Plushie, available now. Like I said, link in the video description below. Are you cleaning up the mess you made? They're like, now we're cleaning up the mess we made. <laughs> All right, you guys, as always, we hope you enjoyed today's video. If you would like to see more of our treat videos, there will be some links down in the video description below and also on the screen here. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big, and we will see you again soon. The dogs are like, Mom, we're leaving you to go see if we can get back in the kitchen to get more snacks. Goodbye, audience.